What is up guys? We are back with another tabletop video and for this video we will be looking into these base pads from Zev. So these base pads will turn your standard 17 rounder into a 22 rounder okay so these are plus five base pads so here's my setup so this so this is my war belt or this part where i keep my magazine pouches okay so i have three 17 rounder glock magazines so totaling at 51 rounds okay so if I add my base pads, that turns them into 22 rounders, giving me a total of 66 rounds. Okay, so this is my home defense rig or my SHTF rig. So I'm very limited real estate. So the more uh, ammo you can pack in my rig, the better. Okay, so let's start with the installation. First off, you're going to want to... get all your mags get your block 17 mags okay so this is your block base pad removal tool i highly recommend that you get one of these uh, i have not had very good luck with removing the base pads without this tool okay so make your life easier get one it's very cheap from lazada okay so Okay. your base pad okay so be careful it's on the spring tension okay and then here you have your follower you take that out okay so what you're gonna need is the follower and the magazine body. So you have your two-piece base plate and your spring. Uh, don't throw these out. These are still good, okay? They can uh, will be useful as a backup in case something goes wrong or the spring wears out on the Zev. So at least you have, you know, a backup spring and the floor plate, okay? So you keep these. And there we go, okay? So let's grab our first base pad. Really sorry guys, it's my first time doing a video with gloves on, so there. Two pieces, okay? So you have your base pad and your extra power spring, okay? So if you notice, for the a lot of counterfeit Zev base pads out there, uh, those counterfeits don't have this logo at the front, okay? So just something be something you should know and then for the follower yeah that's the orientation okay so in the highest point the spring the highest point for the follower should click okay should click like that. Okay. So, okay. These are for now, for the base pad, we have to first remove the floor plate. Okay. And then 
with the floor plate gone you can now push this back okay so yeah my bad take out the spring first and middle part where you can see the notches and that base pad should slide right through okay insert your spring with the follower properly oriented get your floor plate okay push down just do that with the rest so like so okay and we're done okay so that's three mags okay they definitely look cooler compared to stock okay. Ooh. <laughs> look at that Ganta. okay so these three mags are going into my home defense uh, rig and so let's talk about what I'm going to put in. okay so this is my carry ammo federal 124 grain 9 millimeter HST okay so It has good expansion, uh, hollow points, you know, they guarantee maximum lethality without, while well minimizing collateral damage. So, this is my carry ammo. Okay, so I have three mags filled with 124 grain HST. Okay. Fortunately, these cost 120 pesos a piece. So, uh, for my home defense rig, I opted for something more affordable. Okay, so that's where these arm score jacketed hollow points come in. Okay, so as you can see, 124 grains, while the HST is also 124 grains okay so same spec as my carry ammo but uh, obviously at a more affordable price point okay if only i had the, the budget the money <laughs> i'd run I'd, i would run this 100 percent of the time okay so that's your As you can see, parang mas matangkad. Okay. HST is taller. Okay. By a bit. But, you know. They're both 120. They're both 124 grains. So, yeah. that. Okay. Oh. Ganda. Okay. So, hollow points for one third the price. Okay, so let's get that out of the way. And then, okay. okay, so this ammo is uh, provided by Armscore. 
Okay, so I'd like to thank them for sponsoring this video. Thank you very much, guys, and I really appreciate it. Okay, so let's go. Let's load them up. Okay, so we'll we use these on a up Lula mag loaders okay so we learned our lesson from last time Whew! last one Up there. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna use this. Okay. This is also available at Arm Score Shooting Center Inc. Okay. So the way it goes is go over the top. Put your ammo in. I'm oh, sorry, guys. Okay. So see how easy it is. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna take off <laughs> my. I'm just gonna take off my glove, but you know. They... <laughs> but yeah, go. Super easy. Way way faster than you know doing it by hand okay so we're at 15 17 okay and this is where the extra capacity is coming in one two three four last one can we do it okay And there we go. Okay. Okay, so that is a very tight fit. As advertised, plus five, but I'd probably run this with just a plus four. So let's see if it cycles. Loaded that one. I was expecting some kind of malfunction, but because ano, uh, grab yung grab yung spring pressure talaga, guys. So yeah, okay, that one went in. Okay, so. There. Okay. Where are we? Thirty. Okay, guys. So my bad. This was our first mag. I actually loaded it up to twenty-three. That's why we were having problems with that last round. It was actually, I was trying, I was actually getting that last round. So plus six. So, so 
we discovered it by accident you can actually load it to plus six but you know not recommended but i don't think that's what the manufacturer would recommend so let's redo this one so loading 22 yep so two rounds in And 22 rounds. 22, 22, 44. Okay. All, all rounds accounted for so far. My bad, guys. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I was wondering why but a conti nung round nung rounds. Not my even sa cases, yeah. My bad. Okay. So three mags. Okay. okay. So these are battle belt. Okay. So if you haven't seen our video about battle belts, uh, go definitely go check that out. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so my slight hindi naman yeah because when it curves hindi na siya mag when you wear it when I wear it around my belt hindi na siya yeah na, hindi na mag interfere okay so wow okay so yung 51 rounds ko kanina ngayon ano na we're now at 66 okay more ammo it's always better no one ever said wish they had less okay so just for comparison this is your uh, 17 plus 2 okay this is your 17 plus 5 almost no difference okay slight luck okay so might as well you know might as well go with the plus 5 okay And that's our video, guys. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, I'm sorry I haven't been able to go to the range recently, but I promise uh, we'll do uh, we'll do a range uh, testing with this and our previous video, the Chris Vector Mag Extension. And I'd like to thank Armscore Shooting Center for uh, sponsoring this video. And thank you very much for uh, making this happen. And lastly, guys, so since Christmas, there are time giveaway. Okay, so MTAC gun oil. Okay, so we'll, we'll be giving away five MTAC uh, gun oil. Okay, so this is the gun oil that I personally use. Also available in, a sh in our Shopee store. Okay, so just uh, tag three friends <laughs> in the comment section and like and share our video and we'll pick uh, five lucky winners real soon and that's it guys so tag three friends like and share our video and you know get a chance to win the gun oil so that's it guys uh, thanks for watching our video this has been the Zev Base Pad uh, Tabletop unboxing <laughs> uh, thanks for dropping by merry christmas everyone and i'll see you in the next one